It's um, October 20th uh, in uh, Calgary, Alberta, in Canada, and uh, it's day six of our occupation in the really the oil capital of Canada, and uh, it's where all the oil head headquarters are. I uh, just wanted to give you guys a uh, an update on what's what's happened at our camp and what's happened as part of the occupation movement and hope to do this uh, every night to try and recap um, what's happening here let you let you know um, and we've just it's been a strange uh, journey uh, getting to this point we've had days where um, days where we're feeling down and where we have people in our camp and, and uh, that aren't that are that are drunk or, or passing through um, and it's and it can be and it can be sometimes difficult to manage these energies and we've had our own doubts and anxieties as we've confronted the idea of, of the uh, city shutting us down at some point and they've been accommodating so far um, and of course there's all the doubts about whether we can continue to do this, whether our occupation will um, will last, whether we have the the hope to do it, um, and especially you know, especially after last night's, and we actually had to call the 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 uh, the authorities to to help us out, and it was it was tough because how do we confront that in our own community? How do we how do we confront that kind of energy? Um, and yet, today was such a profound day. Uh, we had an amazing uh, General Assembly where we, where we changed, where we occupied our hearts. Um, we really occupied our hearts. And we made commitments that we will stay until we see change. We even made commitments to paint our tents, that our free speech would be our tents. This our, is our statement. Our tents are our statement. And it was amazing. Um, and there was a lot of cheering tonight. Uh, a lot of chants. It was, it was amazing. And a lot of music, a lot of talk. And we finished it up tonight. Um, when we came together in a small group to come up with a mission statement. And we saw what Ottawa, Occupy Ottawa had done, you know, that uh, Ottawa, Occupy Ottawa knew what their needs were. And they came up with a statement, and we wanted to adopt that. But then we wanted to take it further. So we had a mission statement, and we started out with a little bit of meditation and some quiet time. And it was amazing, and we went around in a talking circle and, and put something out there into the universe as funny as it sounds. Um, it was just profound listening to each other and hearing these desires for a better world. It, um, it, it truly was uh, beautiful. I uh, hope you're all doing well out there. Um, I'm going to continue to occupy here. Oh no. Oh, did he lose it? The screensaver came on. <laughs> um, I'm going to continue to occupy here in Calgary for as long as it takes. And it gets cold here. It gets to minus 20 Celsius. Days, I, there are days where I wonder if I can do it. But I hope you guys are all alright. We're doing this in solidarity with all of you out there. The rest of the 99%, and heck, we're even doing it for the 1%. There's more to say, but uh, there are going to be plenty more days. Um, I'm going to turn it over to uh, to uh, a friend, a brother.